Hi everybody, I am Mermaid Christine. I'm a paparazzi independent consultant and tonight is a little bit of a pop-up speed sale. I got a new box of these amazing Life of the Party exclusive pieces and I went ahead and pulled any that were pre-claimed in my album. If you are watching the replay and you're seeing this for the first time, swim on over to the Mermaid Grotto and comment favorite on your favorite Life of the Party piece. Um, one of all five of these pieces are gonna be given away for free as I do every single month. This is the last month I'm receiving Life of the Party pieces, 50 of them for free for earning diamond life of the party the year before. This last year I only earned silver, so I think I'm only gonna be getting one of each of these pieces in the future. I will then be able to take pre-claims and hopefully order more. But I went ahead and made mermaid matches out of all the ones that haven't yet been claimed. So if you see a set that you think looks really good with another um, necklace or bracelet or ring that I put together over here on my table, go ahead and feel free to claim and comment that number now and I will pull it tomorrow. I'll give your comment a heart if you were the first one to claim it on the published post. Hi Jeannie, hi Shell, thanks for coming on. Um, where do you go again? So tap on the screen, hopefully it pulls up the information that I have posted here for new customers to click on my registration link postable.com forward slash mermaid Christine. You don't have to fill it out now, just make sure you fill it out after the live. All right, so I'm gonna turn this camera around and we are gonna do a quick little speed sale with um, Life of the Party pieces. As you can see, I made some mermaid matches out of them. Hey, Darlene, long time no see. And then I'm going to do a quick speed sale with all of the earrings that I have here in stock in the Mermaid Grotto. Um, if there are any necklaces or bracelets or lanyards that you're interested in, um, PM me and I will um, be happy to pull any colors that you're looking for. Okay, so let's get this speed sale party started. The first, um, some of these, by the way, are not even life of the party pieces. like. I pulled this bracelet to go with this Life of the Party necklace and I realized I had it in gunmetal so I went ahead and pulled last month's Life of the Party um, earrings and then made a mermaid match with the necklace and a ring. So I'm going to go ahead and kind of just try to start from left to right and work my way through this um, set, okay? So the first set is going to be this four-piece gunmetal set. We have a black gold ring this is a black gold choker it's got kind of a shiny finish to it a black chunky bracelet with these um fun little chain links and then these gorgeous earrings if you missed them last month i still have two pairs in stock so this first set will be number 56. whoops i just dropped my next tag the next tag if you have not yet claimed it um, Amanda Matif, I know you already claimed this. I think three other people did. I already pulled them, okay? So we still have a couple left. This is the new, um, it's like a stamp of a butterfly engraved on this um, brown leather strap of a snap bracelet. So um, I went ahead and pulled a couple pieces that could work with it. You might want this gorgeous honey golden ring. It's a dainty stretch back ring to go with it. Or you might like these lighter tan earrings to go with it. So this set will be number 92. If anybody wants just the bracelet, you can say 92 bracelet only. Hi, Pamela. Hey, Courtney. Hi, Carla. Thanks for coming on, Tracy. All right, so up next. Oh, I also, I guess, put this chocolatey brown crystal ring. I think that was supposed to go to this set. So you could do um, crystal ring or moonstone ring. Let me know, 92. Okay, I'm gonna stay from left to right. Up next is this possible one, two, three piece set. We've got a bracelet, a necklace. These earrings come with the necklace and I have, I think nine of these still available and one will be given out for free but you have to comment 
on the Life of the Party album under this piece, Favorite, to be entered to win it for free. Um, I pulled all three of these style yellow gold rings. You can say, um, let me give you the number. This will be number 14. You could say left ring, 14 middle ring, or 14 right ring. And this one on the right, I thought went really well with these yellow gold earrings. In case you want any part of this set or just the bracelet, you could say 14 bracelet. All right, so that's the, the only yellow gold set that I have. Below, I also pulled, um, this was a vintage necklace that I just pulled out of the vault because it matches this, um, forgive my permanent marker stain there, it matches these earrings here. It's the perfect color stone. They're the only two pieces I have left in stock with that blue topaz, and this will be set number 70. Beside it, we have last month's Life of the Party. Gorgeous. It's not quite a crackle stone. It's more of a blue acrylic with some green marbling in there. It's a beautiful necklace, but it's very, very close to the turquoise family. So I did go ahead and pull this turquoise crackle stone open cuff bracelet, ring, and then these um, feather earrings. There was another similar pair that sold from my wall drops yesterday. I wanted to make sure I wasn't showing the wrong ones, but that will be set number 50. Oh, and by the way, everybody, um, if you wanna go ahead and hit share on this live, comment shared, because I'm gonna be giving out two Z bracelets, the black pearl Z bracelet and the white pearl Z bracelet for those who share tonight's live. I also have um, a pearl blockbuster necklace and a black pearl necklace that will match it perfectly. So um, two people who share this live will be entered to win one of those two sets, the white pearl or the black pearl. Okay, up next, ooh, let me just real quick turn this background again. These earrings that I started tonight's live wearing, these are post back. I just wanted you to kind of see the size of them here. Um, I pulled, they're this really gorgeous, like a, um, like an inlaid um, mother of pearl type of shell. And it has this um, beautiful kind of a loose kind of design of these little brilliant cut crystals in there. Very, very cool looking. I decided to keep a pair. <laughs> um, so we, um, I think had three pre-claims for those. We still have quite a few left. And I decided to pair it with our seed beads in silver or our seed beads and gunmetal on this invisible fish line necklace. So you can see there's the dark silver and the light silver throughout these earrings. Either one of these necklaces would match. And if you needed a silver ring, this is a beautiful um, hematite ring. And if you wanted just a silver ring, that's another really pretty silver ring. So for this one, we're gonna give it one card, number 99. Oh, I even have down here, I forgot, a stretchy um, hematite and silver bracelet. So this could go with either one. So comment 99 silver necklace, 99 gunmetal necklace, 99 gunmetal ring, 99 silver ring bracelet, or if you just wanna claim the earrings, you can do that here as well and I'll know which ones you mean. Okay, the next set is a dark smoky gray dainty little necklace. I've had this in a few colorways now and I paired it with the earrings. Again, you can say necklace only. That'll be number 34. And then right next to it, I actually have a blockbuster. This is just a single solitaire um, large crisp, round crystal ring or ear necklace. And then I paired it with this matching large round crystal ring with little accent crystals on each side. So that would complement the crystals inside the earring here. So this set could be a three piece set if someone wants it, that'll be number 68. All right, down here, you might've spied me wearing this at the beginning of the live, is this fuchsia, kind of a raspberry hot pink, gorgeous, amazing ring. Um, this one I actually decided to give to my Nana. She is in a um, 
kind of assisted care facility right now following her surgery. So I sent that to her to kind of make her day sparkle. So this one has already been given away for free, but we still have nine left. And I am probably still gonna give one more away for free as well. But if you would like to claim it, um, I put together a little mermaid match here with the same color earrings. This is a little lobster class bracelet and then the ring. So this set would be number 29. If you're not into the big chunky monkey look, I do have that same color crystal ring with this double channel set crystal band. If I can get that to focus. And it also matches that same style bracelet and this set will be number 47. Also, if you shared, make sure you comment share because it won't tell me who shared um, if we're not Facebook friends. All right, so up next is a super, probably one of the most blingiest blockbuster necklaces. Comes with these absolutely fantastic earrings that match. And then of course, I paired it with this beautiful ring and this set will be number 30. All right. Up next, this is a pretty hot set. If you haven't yet found um, a set you like with these earrings yet, this might be it. I love this open cuff channel set crystal to complement that bar. See that long silver bar there? I thought that that really worked nicely with that bracelet. And then this is another vintage necklace that I really liked. It's not too over the top. It's a shorter style, just a little bit of bling. So this is kind of more your accent. And then I went ahead and paired it with this dainty, stretchy back, um, double row crystal ring. So this set will be number 52. All right, up here, if you loved these earrings, how amazing is that seed bead necklace? So this seed bead necklace all by itself is gonna be number 37. I don't know if it's gonna stay. Okay, and then this set down here, this is more of our smoky gray crystals. Um, if you can see, it has the same matching earrings, but it does 100% match these earrings. And I went ahead and pulled this gorgeous, I don't know how it hasn't sold yet, stretchy um, smoky gray crystal bracelet. Again, I'm happy to split this set. This will be number 41. But first to comment the set on the published post will get the whole set if somebody wants the whole set. If they don't, I'm more than happy to split. Um, the next set I put together is two um, teardrop shaped diamond um, mermaid match sets. And this is a solitaire necklace. It does come with your tassel earrings, but um, I think these match much more blingy beautifully. And then I went ahead and paired it with this, again, pear-shaped um, Life of the Party exclusive piece for this month. So this set will be number 19. Hi, Lucy. Hey, Catherine. Hi, Amy. Thanks for coming on, ladies. Make sure that you share and comment share it. I'm going to be giving away two Z bracelets with matching necklaces to two lucky winners. All right, so this one, let me try to turn this around. This is the new... Uh, life of the party necklace and it's dark outside our windows aren't letting in natural sunlight so you can't really see the full spectrum but this is a very sparkly um, longer you can see it's gonna hit um, there's my belly button so it's pretty long um, just want to give you a kind of dimension there long style necklace and it does have these little um, crystals and little heart charms that hang from it and then it's got all these gorgeous faceted cuts in here to really reflect the light. I paired it with this bracelet that I always thought was very sweet. I like the hearts on the bottom of this necklace here. So I had one of these heart um, lobster class bracelets with little crystals inside. This could be a cute ankle bracelet. If you wanted to add an extension chain, I can include one for free for you. Um, this set will be number, not 800, number eight. And you're gonna have to let me know if you want one of these plain crystal rings, top, middle, or bottom. This is um, not as big as the one I'm wearing, but it's a pretty big, large statement ring. This one was another Life of the Party exclusive. And then the bottom, 
was one of my all-time favorite styles called Glam, Glam, Glam of Thrones, I think was the name. And um, uh, Christy Erdman just got this ring for free in her last package. So don't buy this again. You already got it, okay? But I thought it matched really pretty with this necklace. So that would be number eight, top, middle, or bottom. And I'll know which one you're talking about. Okay. Um, this isn't part of life of the party, but this is, um, last month's fashion fix earrings. I still had one pair of these available and then I still have somehow the, um, spring loaded hinge bracelet that went with it. That matches perfectly. I paired it with this kind of simple silver ring because I just thought, you know, I didn't have the purple ring to match in the same exact color, so I thought this could match just fine. And then down here, we have this gorgeous purple crystal, purple heart, and um, little stone necklace. So this would be a one, two, three, four piece set. And it, I only have one of all four of these pieces. This is literally the only set. That'll be number 18, and I am happy to split it. Okay, in the Mermaid Grotto, I did a wall drop with um, with these two key, ring, uh, key necklaces. And the pictures on the stock image just don't give it justice, so I wanted to show them live real quick. Um, just pulled these out of the vault. This is a retired color crystal from maybe even two years ago now. They don't really release jewelry in that color anymore, and I was thrilled to have a ring and necklace to match. With this, um, dark hematite stone. I pulled this gunmetal and hematite, it's kind of a Z lightning bolt shaped design, or this was one of my favorite. This was a Life of the Party exclusive from maybe four months ago. So that also matches beautifully as well. So just let me know top or bottom. Um, the gunmetal will be number 73 and the blue set will be number 89. Okay, last, I just pulled this. This was still wrapped mint in package. I still do have this gorgeous, um, very unique style stretch bracelet. It has your large pearls on one half, and then on the other half, it has the string of different size, smaller micro pearls. And then I love these gorgeous um, little bling balls here. So um, that was part of the fashion fit. This is a paparazzi custom designed um, Fiercely Fifth Avenue set from I think last month or two months ago. It has a nice large size pearl necklace. It's a little bit longer with a um, larger pearl that then kind of ties them together. And then this ring, I actually ordered an extra one just for myself. Me and Courtney both just got the ring and I think the earrings, the earrings are to die for. Look how mermaidy those are. They have that same bling bead in there with those pearls and then the tassels. So this set will be number 91. And I'm happy to split it if anybody wants it split. All right, up next we have two of these oh so popular um, magnet closure bracelets. These are really easy to put on. And this one has your kind of black leather straps with this silver buckle with a hammered finish. And it's gonna be hard for me to there we go. Do it one-handed, but I wanted to show the ring that I paired with it. This is a marquee-shaped um, black faceted crystal, so I thought that was a cute set. And then for this one, somebody asked me if I still had this silver ring in stock with that S shape. I don't remember who, but if you're watching now, um, here it is, and I went ahead and paired it with this other... Um, magnet closing stretch bracelet. So this has your silver crystals and little silver charms. So these sets will be number 25 black or 25 silver. All right, now we're gonna do something a little bit different. Normally when I do a, um, an earring speed sale, I would just show you real close up on the board and you know, try to um, zoom along there and show you um, the earring and then the, the number. But it's so hard to see how they would look on the ear or how big or how little they are. So I'm gonna try something a little different. I hope that um, this doesn't take too, too long. But um, 
Let's see if I can do it this way so that you can see it against the ear. All right, so I took those off so I can model. Let's start from left to right. I'm gonna work my way down here so that my arm's not killing me the whole time. I'll save the pain for the very end. All right, so we have some um, feather-shaped earrings. These have a little black stone along the top there, if you can see, with that leaf or feather-like design. And these will be number 32. Is this backwards for you guys? Is that the right way, 32? Let me know. All right, so 32. All of these, I, I actually kind of organized this wall over the last few days. They're kind of in chronological order or by type, like I have all my hoops here. We're gonna look at all the black earrings first and then we'll move on to um, some of the other colors and styles. So this is our um, black sandstone. I wonder if I'm gonna need my magnifying lens. I do have it. So just in case I need it, I'm gonna have it right here. All right, so these ones are your silver fish hook backs and they're gonna be number 94. Is that right? 94, I'm just gonna have to do it both ways because I don't wanna do it backwards the whole entire night thinking that I'm right. All right, these are very fun and different. These are um, post backs. They're not your um, fish hook backs. And these will be number 61. These are also your black sandstone with some pretty little antique wash in there. All right, now these ones are not your um, black sandstone. These are actually like a polished shiny stone. And these have your crystals all the way around the edges. And they would match this ring beautifully because they both have the black and the crystals. Let me show you the detail up close. Hey Ben, I'm live, okay? All right. There's the ring. And here's the earrings. And if you want any black stone necklaces, let me know, I'm happy to put those together. This set will be number 80, 80. Next up, we have these triangular shaped earrings, again, with a black stone in the middle. These are your fish hook backs, and they have kind of like a little tribal design inside. These will be number 42, 42. I might just hold my camera for the top row because I can tell this is gonna take longer than I wanted a speed sale to take. Um, earlier today, was it Stephanie that claimed the orange pair of these? This is the black pair. And these again have kind of this like fun little tribal design. Look at my eyes go right through it. I love when that happens on accident. Um, reminds me of Harry Potter every time. One of my uplines just was posting about that. So anyway, these will be number three. These are your black stones on your silver earring. And then we're gonna move into some yellow gold now. These are a fun, um, longer, um, almost like a scaled-like design, the way that these little charms kind of overlap one another. Kind of a large style, but very, very light, super, super light. Only have one of all of these, you guys. This is all my earrings. I emptied out my entire um, vault over the weekend, or actually late last week, and pulled a bunch of jewelry from my team. All right, so this is your yellow gold post backs with your ivory crackle stone. So these are gonna be number 72. 72. Up next, I know that these are gonna look black probably on your end. They're actually navy blue, dark navy, and that hammered yellow gold. These are long, like you can't see it against my black shirt, but they're gonna like brush and whisper along your shoulder. If you have a short neck like me, if you have a long neck, maybe not. All right, so these are gonna be number 87. And I promise if you're new, I'm not ignoring comments. I will answer everyone's um, comments tomorrow. Any questions? I just, this is a speed sale, so I'm trying to get through these quickly. Um, we have these gorgeous moonstone and pink or blue post back earrings. These um, could be a good uh, gender reveal earrings to wear, to own, which ones, you know, will it be boy or girl, maybe twins, something like that could be fun. These will be number 39 pink or 39 blue. Pink or blue, 39. All right, up next, I'm gonna show you all my hoops. I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight pairs of hoops in stock. 
These are copper with some antique wash. They have some little round beading along the edges. And these will be number 33. 33 for these smaller size hoops. Up next, we have one of my favorite hoops. I own these. These were part of a fashion fix set. I will real quick zoom in. These are in silver and they're going to be number 64, number 64. And I also think these are the perfect size hoop. Just my taste. All right, up next we have a larger, very light, kind of an antique um, silver. They've got that antique wash throughout that hammered finish to give them a little bit of, uh, almost like a tiny bit of a cheetah type design to them. These will be number 49. 49. Up next, we have a super shiny polished hammered silver with this kind of um, little, I don't know, like the, it reminds me of like the, the bowl, the globe is half full or something, but these are going to hang about here, kind of like my perfect size hoops, and these will be number 46. Only one pair of all of these. Okay, got to get that, otherwise I'll never be able to figure it out. We have two the largest size hoops that I have in stock, very lightweight, and I have them in brass or yellow gold. Super large, super light, and um, super fun. So brass or yellow gold, number 79, 79. I think that normally I flip the screen on myself and I forgot to do it this time so I have no clue which um, side it's supposed to be. All right, so these are uh, another pair of Fashion Fix exclusive brass earrings. These are short, they're a little bit wider, but they're still pretty lightweight and they actually do have a very faint, um, kind of like a, a brushed type of stripe design give it a little bit of dimension it makes them look I think more expensive and these will be number two number two all right up next I have two possibly maybe even still three pairs of these in stock this is your gun metal and um, it's a super shiny finish with your channel set um, larger style larger size crystals that go almost all the way to the very back and these are also um, a kind of medium to smaller size, not too big at all. These are going to be number 16. Number 16. All right, the last hoops for the night are these little twisted brass ones. They have your antique um, finish as well, and they are definitely on the smaller size. These will be number 24. 24. Okay, we're going to go down to the second row now, and then I'll do it super fast in the sale. All right, these were very similar to a pair that somebody had wanted, and I said, I'm so sorry, I only had one pair. And then I found these that were pretty close um, in design. So if you've been looking for ones this length, this type of sparkle, these are gorgeous brass um, earrings. And I do have, not on my rack here, but yes, I do have it on my rack. Ooh, this was a Life of the Party exclusive from maybe a year ago. I think I have two of these left in stock, unless it was one of the ones I gave to my team members. This has that same um, brass crystal inside with the matching uh, tassels at the bottom. So this is, a, as you could see, a little bit shorter than the one that I'm wearing right now. All right, so this set, I'm gonna put it together as a set will be number six, number six. All right, that worked out nice. Okay, these are really little. If you're like my Aunt Patty and you can't wear the big heavy earrings, these are a fun little brass, almost like a little um, sunflower design, super lightweight. And these are gonna be number 95, 95. These are your post backs in brass with a hammered finish. 
very funky cool design sorry guys my alarm just went off telling me to lock up the chickens um i don't know if it interrupted my broadcast or what we have three more brass pairs after these and then we'll move on to some other colors and crystals um these are a brass pair of leaves that i think would be very um fun for the fall time in florida we don't really have fall so dressing up in fall colors and fall jewelry is the only way we can really celebrate fall these will be number 22. 22. I love these ones. These ones have a gorgeous, um, almost like Victorian-like design to them. And they're in that marquee shape, which I just think is always very, like, feminine. These will be number 15. Number 15. And if any of these are going too fast and you would like to see them in person, just take a screenshot and I can um, put together mermaid matches with necklaces that match or bracelets or rings that I may have in stock or um, if you have any outfits that you would like me to match jewelry to. That's always been um, one of the fun things I enjoy doing when somebody showed me, I need help. What do I wear with this outfit? So feel free to message me with any uh, clothes or wardrobe jewelry needs. All right, so these are another pair of brass earrings that have a um, very lightweight. The tassel isn't a real tassel. It's like little beads. And these will be number 59. 59. All right, this is the last brass pair. And these ones are as vent vintage as when I first joined paparazzi. I sometimes still get them as a hostess reward and they have that fun kind of, I always say like a caveman type drawing inside them and they kind of swing on this little bar and these breast earrings will be number 79, 79. Thank you, Jeannie. Hey, Miranda. Thanks for coming on. Thank you, Nancy. All right. So then up next, we have this gorgeous deep red almost like a wine colored crystal earring with a twisted silver um, top these ones are fish hook backs but they're very lightweight even though they're very again that marquee long elongating shape i really like these will be number 21. up next i have two and i think i own both of these colors i really these are more casual you can wear them you know just running around doing groceries but um these are like a gray crackle stone and then a blue turquoise um crackle stone earring so the gray is like very neutral goes with anything and then um the blue obviously if you have any type of blue in your shirt it could pop blue eyes um whatever you could wear a white shirt and it would pop beautifully these will be number 17 blue or gray 17 blue or gray i might have to you know what it is the fish hook back keeps swinging right or left once it's in the ear i think they would stay straight okay i thought i was gonna have to do a little jewelry operation on it all right up next we have some round um marquee shaped crystal earrings these are you know not too huge but they're going to give a lot of sparkle and these will be number 12. number 12. these were pretty um popular these were a large post back earring and um oh they match that ring beautifully very elegant looking like people who don't like to wear fake jewelry you, they could wear these and they'd look like a million bucks wearing them like my friend's mom susan she could wear these dana could wear them my grandmother could wear them um these will be number 45. i think i may have one extra pair in my box still all right up next i own these and these are a tiny tiny bit on the heavy side i'm kind of sensitive to earrings if they're too heavy so i I wear these and I don't want to wear them like all day long and all night long. Like I'll take them off after a few hours. So just wanted to give you that heads up. There's a lot of rhinestones in there and um, they do have a teeny bit of weight to them. I have two of these available. These were also Life of the Party exclusives and these will be number 10. These also have like your antique uh, wash inside there. So it really makes the diamonds pop um, with that black backdrop. Actually, the next three have that antique wash. These are all going to be sparkle diamonds. 
these are my last life of the party exclusives um very very popular i think especially among consultants i've seen a lot of consultants use like their professional photos with these earrings on very very popular because they're stunning they're really really gorgeous and i think that the chain up here allows it to be more casual if you wanted to go more like kind of t-shirt but if you wanted to get fancy of course you've got the sparkle these will be number 85 last pair last pair these are another fun antique wash, super pop, bright, um, rectangle shape if you're into geometry. These could be fun. Number 60 for those square shaped uh, fish hook backs. All right, the next four styles are all gonna be jacket style earrings. Um, these ones are brass and they have two different, um, maybe even three different little holes that you can determine where you want them to hit behind your ear and they have a little champagne crystal on the top as your you could wear this as a single stud and then they have the crystals on the bottom as well these are going to be number five number five hey christina thanks for coming on hi stephanie all right up next we have another pair of jacket earrings with gorgeous um, little yellow gold studs or white gold. And these have your pearls along the bottom. So these ones kind of fan out underneath the ear and then show that little row of pearls. I love these, I own them in the, the silver because I don't wear yellow gold too, too often. These will be number 20 silver or 20 yellow gold. Whoops. Hi, Candace. How are you doing? Hi, Christian. Oh, oh, while he's on, while he's on, I gotta do something. I said one day I'm gonna do something for Christian. Hang on. I'm gonna take you on a little field trip, okay? Gotta unhook you from my charger. All right, so Christian, come with me into this little area by my front door where I have some urban style necklaces I sometimes keep men's jewelry here i hope mom says this is okay these are going to be for free this is a cool little men's uh it looks like a bullet i don't know if that's not appropriate mom we could switch it out for this cool zebra necklace i think i might just include that anyway and what else do we have any other guys stuff here i um i just had a merman join my team and here you go, Christian. We got a little boy's bracelet here. And I put together 10 pieces to send him for free um, and so that he can model the jewelry. And so I don't have much men's in stock, but I also have this brown urban bracelet. Okay, so Christian, you're getting all four of these pieces for free. Everybody uh, give some hearts and send some thumbs up for Christian. And... Um, I will get your little merboy mail out tomorrow, okay? All right, let me get my charger. My daughter has been playing Roboblox and uh, using my phone to friend all her friends all day long, so my phone is like on its last leg. All right, we have two more pairs of jacket earrings left. Um, I actually have two of these in yellow gold. These are, yeah, those are for you, Christian. All those hearts, those are, I wish I could send some right now. Here. Here's my hearts for Christian. <laughs> um, here are two yellow gold pairs of jacket earrings as well. And these have, okay. So these will be number 71. And I have two of those available as you can see. All right, last pair of jacket earrings are these kind of sunburst, really cool designs. They have a little triangle post that you would um, put on the top part of your ear. And then this little sunburst would kind of beam out from underneath the ear. These ones will be number 62. 62. All right, so now we're gonna flip the camera around and I'm just gonna carry the phone up high and just hang these tags on it really quick, okay? So bear with me as we um, do a third type of speed sale. So first I show jewelry laid out on a table then I showed it on my ear and hung it up on the wall. And now we're just going to put tags right on the wall. So look how, doesn't that just look so nice and organized? Woo! 
Ooh, that looks great. Okay, hopefully we have enough cards to finish what's up on the wall. All right, I'm gonna try to reach as best as I can. We have a silver earring with some little silver crystal hematite accents that are gonna be number 67. Up next, we have these kind of big flowers with a bright orange stone in the middle. These will be number 48. We have yellow moonstones. This will be very pretty for the fall or summer. Christina McDermott, these might match your necklace. These will be number 58. She just got that new life of the party necklace. I mean, fashion fix one. Look how beautiful these crystal and chocolate pearl earrings are. If you have brown eyes or wearing a brown dress or brown hair, I think that could be really pretty. That'll be number 93. Beside these, I have these beautiful silver and plum purple earrings. These will be number 009. I still have two pairs of these yellow gold with dangle chain, a white iridescent like moonstone earring, very mermaidy, number 54. I have two pairs left of these kind of mango, they always remind me of fishing lure style earrings. These will be number seven. I have these purple silver earrings with these little almost like floral little flowers at the bottom of those spears. Very pretty, light, lightweight, number 90. I have, I think this might be the only rose gold pair of earrings in stock. They have that kind of brushed bottom half and the shiny top half, almost like a hoop style earring, number four. I love these. These are um, my birthstone, sapphire blue marquee crystals surrounded by crystal stones, clear diamond-like stones. Those are gonna be number 98. Besides these, I have, uh, it doesn't, it looks super bright red on your end, but these are more of a almost maroon red, like a deeper red with that beautiful silver antique filigree. These will be number 69. I believe these are my only pair of acrylic earrings in stock. Um, these are um, post backs in blue and a really pretty denim, a denim blue and red and white. These will be number 77. Up next, another fall favorite. I own these as well. These just look like Thanksgiving colors to me. And I love the three tiers and they're light and they're long and they're fun and they're number 35. We also have these beautiful yellow stone earrings with gorgeous little um, silver filigree around them. These will be number 81. I have these as well in my personal collection. I should just say like half of these I probably own. Uh, maybe not that much, but a lot. I love the little lace bottom of these as well. Very lightweight, number 84. And if I say lightweight a lot, it's because I want you to know that even though some of these are large, they're still very lightweight. These are also gonna be great for the fall time, a beautiful deep pumpkin orange. Only have one of those. Ooh, that's actually number 100, not number one. Next to them are soft baby pink stone with a pretty flower and little floral design. These are gonna be number 11. Besides those, I have a yellow gold pair of beautiful um, little round pearl. These would be great for like 13 year olds, 15 year olds. They're not heavy at all. I have them in yellow gold with like an ivory pearl and then in silver with this really pretty baby blue. So you can say um, yellow gold or silver, number 51. Besides these, I have the um, emerald green little tiny crystal in here. Super lightweight silver medallion style coin like earrings number 57. Next to these, I have one pair in black gold and then two pairs in silver of these super lightweight, funky geometric earrings, number 88. 
I really like these. I ordered them and almost kept them because sometimes you just need a little something to go with like maybe denim or something. These are a little copper earring, number 63. Next to these, we have the all-knowing eye. They look like a little eyeball with eyelashes. These are post back and they do have a little iridescent uh, clear milky stone in there. These will be number 38. Sorry, my arms are getting weak. My biceps are so weak um, and I'm so short. But my foot's doing great. Look at me standing on my feet, doing great. <laughs> I'm so proud to be able to walk again. All right, this is a bright neon yellow faceted stone earring. This one is actually number one. Beside these, I still have these. I think Rhonda, you asked for these. I already pulled them for you. I still have one, maybe two left in stock. Those are that beautiful royal blue post back earring. That's gonna be number 43. These ones, I know they look so long and huge. So I'm gonna go ahead and turn the camera around just so you could see the height. Um, I own these, they're really fun, they're light. This isn't a gemstone in the middle, it's just a um, silver kind of cut to them to make them look like a faceted stone. But they are your post backs and they are um, surrounded by little crystals that are clear and they're gonna be number 44. Up next, I have this Peridot crystal um, hoop-like earring, two pairs, number 27. I can't believe I still have these in stock. These are a gunmetal, very lightweight, post-back, um, uh, Fashion Fix exclusive. Like we can't order those. They just came with Fashion Fix one month. Those will be number 86. And then we still have one pair of these amethyst purple, very feminine, pretty chandelier style earrings, number 23. And then I made this part of a mermaid match the other day, but I don't think anyone claimed it. So I'm gonna go ahead. These are copper earrings and I'm gonna give these the number 55. And then two more left. Sorry guys, my arm's just so weak. Here's a shiny copper medallion earring. These will be number 83. And then last but not least, are these, oh, this is that um, topaz blue hidden inside there. My mom has these. She actually, I think, bought them twice because she likes them so much. Um, two pairs of those still available, and those are gonna be number 53. Okay, woo, that was a good So everybody, if you um, wanna watch the replay, feel free to shop the replay. If you are looking for anything specific, I have been pulling pieces out of my vault and hanging them up in color chronological order. It's much easier for me to find pieces now. So if there's anything that, um, again, that you're looking for that maybe even sold out a while ago, like um, I'm finding stuff that I thought I had long sold out of and I'm like, oh my gosh, I just found it again. All right, so basically, um, PM me with any questions and feel free to shop the replay. Also, feel free to look through the wall in the mermaid grotto as I posted some mermaid matches against a white blouse just to show you how you can change up your outfit. The same shirt you can wear over and over again with different necklaces and earrings and accessories and it looks like a whole new look. All right, everybody, have a great rest of your night. Thank you so much for shopping. I will fulfill those claims tomorrow, and then I will invoice on Friday, and then I will ship next Monday. You have all weekend to pay, but please don't make me chase everyone down and keep sending reminders. There are still six unpaid invoices from not just last week, but even a couple from the week before. So if you could, please pay those on time. It, um, it makes it a lot easier for me not to have to keep storing sometimes hundreds of pieces, hundreds of dollars worth of jewelry that's claimed but not yet paid. All right, everybody, have a great rest of your night. I hope you're all doing well, and I send you all mermaid kisses and starfish wishes.